Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play. Give us a Kufu adventure. With me, Demonox. When we last left off, um, a strange package arrived. It then exploded. And our detective got dragged off. Right as well. Uh, we can't do anything else at the moment except this thing. And we lost as much as we can, so we gotta play with it. Knock it off for sure, but I can't reach that high. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, inventory. Ah, shoo. I just realized how long I've actually wanted to do this. Dawn sends his regards, ugly. What the? Bunk. Ah, that didn't shatter much. Yeah, the book? Or an eyeball? Huh. I was um, expecting something more. But it's a book with an eyeball. Is, is this what Dawn was after? This looks nothing like the other editions. Creep factor just went up 200%. Who'd hide it up there and why? Um, You're coming with me, weird book. I looked at it, I didn't want to pick it up. I never thought I'd actually say this, but the Necronomicon feels weird in my pants. Oh boy, what an evening. Think, Buzz, think. Dawn's been kidnapped. The police? Or a bunch of corrupt and incompetent tools, what do I do? Well, Orn can close up for the night. Things are way too messed up to stick around. The best thing to do is retreat to the bus cave, clear my head, and see what this strange book is all about. A bus cave? Really? Wow. This was called a man cave. Hello, kitty. Uh, okay, safely home. What? What the hell was all that about? Is this really happening? Am I really talking out loud to myself? What is this book? God, I need to stop talking to myself. I sound crazy. Kitty, should I open this thing and see what's written in it? What do you say? Uh, you're a lot of help. Okay, might as well take a peek. Yeah, yeah. Kashaptuzi Dinger Kampa. Per Adonai Methatron. Um, stop reading the book. What the? This is genuinely becoming really scary now, and yeah, I'm all alone. Read. What do I do, Kitty? God, I wish you could talk back for once. Oh, I just cast a spell. I just got myself wish powers. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> the cat is glowing. Okay, let's glow now. Okay, I know I've been saying everything felt weird before, but that was really, really weird. Something feels very different now. As much as I hate agreeing with you, something does feel very different now. I know, right? Maybe reading that out loud wasn't such a good idea, huh? It sure seems so. Right? I mean... <laughs> we now have a conversation with Kat. Whoa, 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 wait. Are you actually talking back to me? Took you a while, huh? I feel like we were in a much more productive place a few moments ago. You know, analyzing the situation. Maybe working toward a solution? You talk. I stand corrected. You seem to have a firm grip on the situation. Yes. How? You just read an incantation and then wished out loud that I could talk back. So... This is wrong. This can't be happening. This is wrong. Wait, I know. I'll just find the spell or whatever it is and reread it and reverse this. That, that should work, right? You're not really expecting any kind of relevant answer from me, are you? Right, I mean... Is. Oh, oh, what the... It's gone. I can't so find it anywhere. Deal. I had 
this was definitely the page I read it from, but there's there's different text on it now. What the? Should I read it out loud? Wait, sorry. I wasn't considering your point of view here. Do you want to be a... Talking cat? Please don't take this the wrong way, but that's a resounding and definitive no. I just don't want your kind of problems, man. My deal is sleeping, eating, and generally being decorative. I can yeah, get behind helps. that. Yes. Okay, here goes. Uh, <laughs> um, let's see. Shuru limata, limata, anaku lub Who writes this stuff? Ding dingi ana kapa. Let's try them. Um, do do do. Boop. Shunu limutuma anaku lublui. Zidinjir Anakampa. I wish Kitty would go back to normal. Did it work? <coughs> Darn it, can't even meow right anymore. I think it's safe to say it hasn't. Oh boy, this is a problem. This is Don't a mess problem. with the button. Uh, by the way, Kitty, nice to meet you. We've known each other for years, dude. Kitty. Is that what I call you? Uh, haven't you been doing it for years already? Dumb snake possible if you ask me, but I don't care either way. I don't need one. So, are you gonna stick around? No, I'm gonna walk the earth like Kane in Kung Fu. <laughs> You'll stick around and undo this. You really think I want to be like you for the rest of my life? That's gotta be racist or, or something. We're not even the same species. We need to find a way to reverse this, yeah, so get to thinking. Yeah, you're right. Nah, I'm on it. Got a point. We are not the same species. So... Oh, look at that eye. Follow the eye. Follow my icon, kitty. <laughs> Alright, what can we actually interact with in this room? We got the tablet, oven, fridge, lighter, remains of cake, frame picture of Kitty, action figures, posters, and frame picture. <coughs> we can now. That's Ron Dilbert. He's really grumpy. Yes. Kitty? Never pay more than 20 bucks for a computer game. Never pay more than 20 bucks. Can I take it? Ron can't help us now. Okay, what about the postal? We'll click on everything Scenic now. Scenic Transylvania. That's where my roots are. Man, I hope I get to visit someday. <sighs> okay, I've got to get my head back in the game. Now, will Kitty have a different scene to save these things? Yeah, yeah, pretty. Let's move on. Yes, yeah, she does. Okay, good. They're not toys, okay? I don't play with them. Well... I don't like this new situation at all. <laughs> What's left of my once impressive action figure collection? I guess I'm growing or something. <laughs> and Kitty's gonna be the sarcastic. Please don't drag me into your immaturity. Too late. Oh, well, That's yeah. Kitty. My, uh, Kitty. Yeah, I know. Not the most imaginative name. Totally understandable. Really? Yes, really. If I were called Buzz, I'd be reluctant to get creative when naming anyone, too. Touche, Pussycat. <laughs> What's new, Pussycat? Whoa, 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 whoa. I'd say she looks cute, but she's within earshot. Stop. <laughs> it's an embarrassing baby picture. Move on. Okay, uh, I feel like the tablet might actually be the way to go forward. But we'll get everything first. My tablet. It's been charging for two days now. You should get that scene too. Dead as... well, dead. If it's been charging for two days and has not yet recharged, your batteries may be dead. I don't think I'll bother her What's about it. Not plugged in. Whatever. It's our oven. 
I'm deathly afraid of it. Long story. Would you like to get involved, Kitty? Look, I'm afraid to touch the thing. I have this long-running fear of leaving the gas on, and then the dorm explodes, and I'm not even slowly walking away from it. I just stand there in tears. No. Uh -huh. Hey, Kitty, think you can uh, open that oven for me real quick and, and take a peek inside? Sure thing, boss. As soon as I grow opposable thumbs, <laughs> you're gonna have to man up and do it yourself. Come on, Buzz. You can do it, dude. Uh, I can? Yeah, it's just fear. Stupid fear. Yes! <laughs> fear is the path to the dark side. Fear leads to anger. Oh, nope. Anger... Open the damn oven, Kerwin! Yeah, yes, yep. <laughs> I did it! Hey, and there's Lemon's key. Oh, and there's a cookie in here. A suspicious one. Why is there a suspicious cookie in the oven? I <laughs> cookie. <laughs> I think I'll take it, you know, for sustenance. Ugh, I would not recommend you eat that. <laughs> I'll take it. Oh, let her open the cookie. Have a cookie. Oh, wow. Um... Suspicious cookie. Very suspicious cookie. Effects remain to be determined. It's the key to Lemon's domain of derelict degeneracy. All right. It's the dreaded Necronomicon. Hey, can you want a book? Tried that. Didn't work. We have to find another way. Would you like a cookie? She's a carnivore. And smart enough not to touch Lemon's cooking. All right, that is a good point. Yeah, she doesn't have opposable thumbs. Damn, man, no thumbs. Well, that's her tiny fridge. Tiny it's fridge. usually either full of lemons, dubious cooking, or completely empty. Nah, I can open it myself. Open the fridge. Hey, it's not completely empty. Huh? Kang of Doctor Fisher. It's a can of Dr. Fisher, produced exclusively with fish materia water. That ensures my lips will never go anywhere near it. I demand you drink the can. I prefer Poopsie. She's not into sodas. Mine. I'm gonna grab this. Dr. Fisher. Oh. Always close your fridges, that way they don't lose all the, all the heat in. Uh, it's our one and only treasured lighter. Actually, can I, cl no, can I close the oven now? Well, Lemon's lighter. I'm kind of afraid of working the stove or oven. In case we explode. Get it yourself, you're the one with opposable thumbs. Gonna grab this for a while. I don't think he's gonna do much. Not interactive with it, it seems, because Kitty Ki doesn't have thumbs. Do you want the can? Keep that toxic sludge away from my whiskers, man. Would you like a lighter? She's cold, but that wouldn't help. <laughs> Remains of cake. That's been there since Lemon left for that esoteric retreat. I'm frankly afraid to touch it. Why is it on the bin? Whatever was in it has probably grown more powerful with time. Not hey. in your life, buddy. You got nine lives. I got my fill of suspicious sweets. And this would be the door to Lemon's room. Beyond this impenetrable portal adorned with god-awful decorations lies Lemon's Shangri-La. His room. He's such a hippie, it hurts me mostly. I see. I can squeeze under doors. Lemon knows that. He made this door particularly unsqueezable under, remember? Oh yeah, he did do that. Hmm. Lemon's locked the door when he left for that esoteric retreat, and of course he has no phone signal or internet. Great. Kitty, I'm a little stumped here. I have no idea I have what to do next. We're clearly in over our heads. 
Maybe we should reach out to someone who knows more about this black magic thing. Mm, you've got a point. Wait, how about my roommate, Lemon? He's my roommate too, remember? Yeah, he does know a lot of people. A lot of suspicious people. They're really into his homemade cookies, for some reason. Suspicious people is definitely uh, what we're after. Man, I've homemade. seen him write down names in this little notebook. Maybe we should look for it. Uh, he's away on that esoteric retreat thing, though. No way to reach him. We're gonna have to find a way to get inside his room. key. We literally have the key. The key to the puzzle is right here. Before we do that, I want to look at here and see if there's anything else going on. Nice. I had a door opening animation or something, but okay. There is so much stuff in this room. Ten of all things, whose purpose is to be lit up, this one scares me the least. They should probably scare you the most, mate. But surely, what else? Do I look like a lighter to you? No, but I could. I have one. Yay! Oh, that's gaudy. Hey, looks like there's something under this. Move it yourself, Buzz. No. Oh. It's one of those lick oh, 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 uh, tiny cute guitars. Ukulele. It's cute. Ukulele. I don't think she'd be inclined to play that thing. Nope. Can I move it? Oh, no. My band days are long gone. What, you mean he has them? Oh, that's just I wrong. have a feeling somewhere inside this horribly over-decorated piece of furniture lies what we're looking for. My eyes, they water. Yeah, I must be a bit gaudy. All right, Kitty. I have a feeling the notebook we're looking for is somewhere inside this locked closet. I can't really think of a way to open it. Couldn't you just randomly combine some household items into a makeshift key or something? I'm sure I could, but I was thinking maybe you could shoulder this particular burden. <sighs> Let's not make a habit of this. <laughs> Ugh, this patchouli sink is giving me dizzy cells. Oh, here it is. I haven't done that since I was a kitten. Still got it. <laughs> I saw things! No! We must have done the in the room. We will not be... Denied. It's lit up and stinking up the place. Do I look like a lighter to you? No, but it's interesting. That's I think a... it's supposed to be a fertility idol. Kind of scary, if you ask me. That looks more kafuli to me. Just I would not sleep it. with that thing above my head. I'll tell you that. Primitive or not, I doubt Kitty appreciates art. Actually, I've been a little into cubism lately. Snob. We thankfully have no need for it. Okay, there's a... Go to hippie cloth, so I'll move this. What do you know? A pair of scissors. Handy. I'm not sure why, but handy. Nice pair of scissors. These things always come in handy. I am not reading the diary. It's a book Lemon left open. Well, let's see here. Oh, yeah. Page on the left says a compass is a magnetized pin floating in a solution. It's not the 1700s anymore, Lemon. Jeez, what a Luddite. Hey, everything else. Page on the Invisible. right says invisible ink. Use lemon juice to write secret messages on paper. Only you will be able to then read them by bringing the paper close to a source of heat. Note, make that a source of mild heat, not open flame. Hmm. Aha! Uh -huh. Do we have any lemons? No need. I, I can read it myself. Okay. Hmm. Now 
shall we leave the diary? Uh, the pages are all blank. What am I missing here? Right, we need a secret letter thing. Nah, no need to hide it in the little guitar. Can we use it on the book? Nah. Can we use it on Kitty? Kitty can't read. Yeah, keep thinking that. Ah. That's a bad sign if she's a key can actually in fact read. I know we haven't actually progressed much, but I like just clicking and listening to the dialogue. <laughs> it's a point and click adventure game. You're supposed to click and point click on every little thing going. That's how these work. Then you accidentally stumble upon the right solution. That's so, uh, you know, trademark of the game. Okay, I like the fact that both Kitty and the eyeball in the middle are what follow my icon. <laughs> Follow the cursor. Follow my cursor icon. Do, 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 do. Yum, yum. I could do that for a while. <laughs> but anyway, when we come back, uh, we'll actually solve a problem. A puzzle, I think. I don't want to solve it now in case it like, sends me off to another screen and I have to stop. But that's for next time, though. So until then, until then, we shall go forth with Kitty. See ya.